People consistently ask, how can a good God let bad things happen to good people? And the problem is most of us, myself included, underestimate the gravity of our sin, the weight of our guilt and rebellion against God. And we also underestimate how loving and gracious God actually is. And so we, we put in our mind this thing of, all right, well, how can God be so angry over a little white lie? It's not just a little white lie. It's actually an act of cosmic rebellion. It is saying, all right, God, you, the God of all light and truth, that you are not good enough to protect us in telling the truth. You are not worthy of being listened to, and I can do a better job of taking care of myself by telling a lie. I can provide for myself better by stealing. I can get what will satisfy me greater by doing this or that. All these different sins are not just sins or things done that's just me and a little thing here or there. They're actually cosmic rebellion, cosmic treason against God, the creator of the universe, because we're saying we know better than you. And we're saying that to God. Daniel 9, 9 says, to the Lord our God belong mercy and forgiveness, for we have rebelled against him. God's mercy and forgiveness is so amazing that he would, that he would even offer it to us. I'm amazed when I actually contemplate how broken and sinful we are. How broken and sinful I am. And amazed at how loving and gracious God is that he would offer us his mercy and his forgiveness. I hope that as you come to grips each day with the sin in your heart, that you are also wowed by God's loving grace, by his mercy and forgiveness. God bless.